No, I just saw you checking out that poster. You should really join. Camping, fishing, hiking. It's a lot of fun. Sure, I guess. Like you have to is still there? You better watch out. <sighs> to be honest, things at home kind of suck right now. Liam, what happened to your eye? Oh, nothing. Um, I just ran into something. Really? So, your eye. Yeah. He did that? Yeah, he was gonna hit Ryan and I tried to stop. Well, I'm done here for now, and I don't have to go home yet. Do you maybe want to go to Tim's and get some coffee? Sure. Maybe your brain needs a break. Trust me, you need to relax. What the hell? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What I'm the sorry. hell was I'm that? Sorry. Oh god, I'm sorry. Have you ever seen our school mascot? It's a full-on red-skinned chief. You don't think that's just a little racist? Hey. Sign a petition to change the school mascot? James tackled the mascot. What? James? What if we ask Samantha to be a part of this? Right. We know why you want her to be part of this group. Do you know where she's from? Seems like your new friend has you exactly where she wants you. She's dangerous. Are you kidding me? Sam's one of the nicest girls I know. Look, they get free education, free taxes, and all sorts of other kinds of stuff. I'm telling you, she's just using you. Alright, enough, Maya. I can't believe you. Beth, we have English together with Miss Thompson. I notice you sit by yourself a lot. I was thinking that maybe you'd like to come meet some people. There's a huge party this weekend at a friend's house. You interested? Mount more or less. She said she's been trying to ask him for a while, but hitting Ryan was the last straw. So how are things? They're good. No. Really, how are things? They're... they're not bad, actually. It'll take a while for things to feel normal, but they're better than they were before. That's good. So when are you guys leaving for this canoe trip? Uh, the week after next. I'm pretty stoked, actually. It'll be nice to get out of the city for a while. Sounds awesome. Maybe I should join next year. Yeah, that'd be awesome. You know this is vandalism, right? I was just trying to make a point. Surely you could find a better way of making your point than spray painting the mascot and the sign. I tried! I was trying with the petition, but no one listened. So you moved on to felonies? Well, it got people's attention, didn't it? James, the wrong kind of attention. Nobody's talking about changing the mascot. They're only talking about the damage done to the school. I never thought of it like that. I just wanted to get rid of the caricature of my culture. Look, James, I'm not unsympathetic to your point of view here. I've thought more than once about changing the chief as our mascot. Why don't you change it? Well, I'm not the only one that gets to make the decisions on this. Who else gets to decide? Well, the school board, for one. Ugh, 
It's not all that bad. I'd be willing to set up a meeting with the board so that you could try to convince them. Really? Yeah. Provided that uh, you pay for the sign, whether or not the board changes it. I'm not going to pay to put the Chiefs back up on the sign. Look, James, you don't really have a choice in the matter here. Vandalism is illegal. However, if your presentation to them is sufficient enough for them to decide to change the mascot, you'd be paying for the new mascot. I guess I can live with that. Well, hopefully that motivates you to kill the presentation then. Okay. And make some better choices next time, all right? All right. Are you a lawyer? No, I'm a justice of the peace. A what? In order for you to be released, there are certain conditions by which you must abide until you're hearing. Conditions? It's called an undertaking. You have to abstain from alcohol, you'll have a curfew at 10 p.m., you'll have to keep the peace, you'll have no contact with the passenger who is in your vehicle at the time of the accident, and you'll not be permitted to drive. For how long? At least until your court date in a couple of months. You'll have a preliminary hearing in a week where you can enter a plea, but your undertaking will last until your court date, if you choose to plead not guilty. Can I go to school? Yes, anything outside of these conditions is permitted, but if you fail any of these conditions, that may cause you to be brought back into custody. Do you understand these conditions? Yes. Sign here, then you may go. Your parents are waiting for you outside. Hey, Miss Godwin, do you have a minute? Sure, Hannah, what can I do for you? I just have a question about the canoe trip. Yeah? How many people are going? About half a dozen or so. Is Lindsay going? I think so, yeah. Oh. Is that a problem? Maybe. I don't know. Did something happen? A fight or something between you two? No, not early. I don't know. Hannah, you can talk to me about it if you want. I can't. I don't know. Well, something's obviously bothering you. You can talk to me. It's so embarrassing. What happened? Well, we've been hanging out a lot more recently. And? And I thought she liked me. Oh, I see. And she doesn't. Not in the same way that you like her. No, now she probably hates me. She doesn't hate you, Hannah. How many people know you're out? No one. So Lindsay's probably just confused. She wanted to be your friend and you wanted something more. But I do want to be her friend. I just also, I don't really know what I want. Well, how about just starting with being her friend? But she won't want to be my friend after what I did. There's only one way to find out. How's it going? I can't come on the canoe trip. I was wondering if that was going to happen. Why? I've seen the way you look at Sam and David. What's going on there? He won't listen to me, and I can't watch them anymore. What? Why? She's just using him. What do you mean? It's what they all do. They? Don't you think that's a little presumptuous? How much do you know about Samantha? I know enough. Do you really? Have you ever sat and talked to her? No. Maybe you should get to know someone before you pass judgment on them. Whatever. Listen, I just came to tell you I'm not going on your little canoe trip. Hey, Emily. How are things? Oh, hi. Good. Just finishing up some paperwork for the trip. I see. When do you guys go? Right after grad, so pretty quick. Right on. How many kids are going? Well, eight, but people keep dropping out on me. Yeah, um... Beth Evans, she's on physio too, hey, so she's out. Yeah. Hey, yeah, I've been meaning to talk to you about that, actually. Oh? Yeah, you know Aaron, the driver in Beth's accident? 
No, not really. Yeah, I, I've been thinking that she might be a good fit for your group for next year. Are you sure? Yeah, I mean, I looked at her file and she seems like a really good kid, just this drinking and driving thing, so yeah, I might, might be good for her. She's a little long. Ah, I see. Well, fair enough. Thanks for the heads up. Yeah, for sure. No problem. Have fun on your trip. Thanks. You bet. Hey. Oh, hi. What's going on with you? What? You've been avoiding me. No, I haven't. I just needed to think some things through. About what? Well, you know. What, you don't want to be my friend anymore? No, I thought you didn't want to be my friend. You think you're the first person that's hit on me that I'm not attracted to? Oh, I just... I thought you would hate me, because... you know. I'll admit I was a bit surprised at first. But I decided I could care less if you're gay or straight. I just want to hang out with my friends. I'm so relieved to hear you say that. You're not gonna cry now, are you? No, of course not. Here, let me help you with your bag. That's more like it. James, I forgot to ask how your presentation went. It went great. They were actually listening and had a lot of good questions at the end. So, what happened? They voted to stop using Chief as a school mascot. That's awesome. Now, all we gotta do is come up with a logo and a new mascot for the school. How about the um, Fairhaven Falcons? Maybe. I was thinking of the Fairhaven Firebirds. Or just the fire. Yeah. And the mascot could be in flames. Uh, yeah, that might be a bad idea. How about the Fairhaven Fury? That might work. Hey. Hey yourself. What you thinking about? Nothing much. Just enjoying the view. It is pretty spectacular. Yeah. It's too bad we're gonna have to move on. Too bad we just can't stay here. I know. But then we'd be missing out on all the fun we're gonna have over the next couple days. Yeah. So... What? What's gonna happen between us? I don't know. I've been taking Samantha. I think I'm gonna take that scholarship in BC. I thought you might. It's a great opportunity. Yeah. It doesn't mean what we have has to end. But I don't know if I can do long distance. Well, we have the summer. Let's just take it day by day, and we'll go from there. Sounds good. Hey guys, what's up? Nothing much. Just enjoying the view. It's pretty great. This trip's gonna be awesome. Uh, thanks for inviting me to join. No problem, buddy. I'm dreaming wide awake. This is the life I make. I don't need a holiday to make me feel this way. Listen up, take a chance, you can sing, you can dance, you can live like there's no tomorrow. Give it time and you'll find there's a rule, there's a rhyme, move along and the rest will follow.